hello guys in this tutorial we are going to learn how to set up question paper nursery school question paper first thing to do is to go to your document okay go to your msl microsoft word go to new document okay after you get to the new document make sure your layout is in a4 paper if it's not in a4 paper you can come down to this layout so when you come down to the layout come to the size here okay so allow it to pop up first so we allow it to pop up first so it's still loading it's still loading as you can see it's still okay now as you can see here you make sure that you make sure your setup is in a4 paper okay and then your margin you go to margin and you make sure the margin is in what top and left okay so the setup is okay like this next thing to do is to write the name of the school you want to set the paper okay now i'm going to write the name of the school for instance now this one is inspiration okay let me put it in capital letter inspiration inspiration group of school inspiration group of school okay so the address of the school that is that is 37 2 g okay To the shocker phone, school. Okay, to the shocker phone, school of Florida Road. Of Florida Road, Corudu. Google Kurudu So as you can see it here now what we are going to do is to make sure that you write it in normal order okay we can come down to this home and pick it to the middle here yeah? okay as you Take it to the middle here yeah, now you can also take this one to the middle okay let's come down to the home and make sure it's in the middle here yeah, and then you can increase the fonts of this one okay you increase this fonts one and then you can color it if you like okay so as you can see here yeah, now you can also increase the font of this one also so let's increase the font of this one okay so we increase the font of this one like this also okay so this one is too big that is being the one line okay so the next thing to do here the next thing to do here now is to make sure that we rise we continue our setup okay so now we have time allow okay time allow Only there should be space here. Time allow is one hour HR. Okay, so we can put subject here, subject here, like this. Okay, that is English, as you know, English, and then the maximum mark okay maximum mark that is 50 okay now as you can see here now what's next thing to do is to make sure that we roll it like this and then we can also write something here that is not free question okay not free question 
question no strict question okay so the next thing to do is to write and then you just have to room you go to your inserts and then go to this shape okay you can roll like this you can come down to this place and make sure that we underline it perfectly here let's underline it perfectly make sure it's perfect like this okay so when it's like that the next thing to do now is to start the question paper okay I can write this question for that question one now question one okay question one is this copy okay you can copy now that is copy the alphabet okay copy the alphabet alphabet okay copy the alphabet okay so the next thing is to just type here now you can start from shift it to this center of the c you can write a okay when you write a you can write this just press your shift key and then the this one give a space and then write b same thing and give a space also right c right c okay right c and this one and then also you write x okay give a space and you write x s okay now you can make sure you copy everything so that in order to make it large when you copy it you can come to the home here and then increase the font do you see that okay this one is so big and then you can reduce it make sure it's perfect on the line like this okay now so the next thing to do is to come down here to to write alphabet okay write the alphabet against each other you can write now that is right Write, write the alphabet, alphabet, alphabet against each other, against each other, order. Order. okay as you can see we have to increase reduce the font size okay you go back to the, your home and you come down to this and reduce the font size like this okay okay now the next thing to do is to come down here when you come down here you go to inserts okay you go to inserts when you get your insert you move down to shapes okay when you get to the shape look at this triangle shape that is you have to click it here and you come down here and you draw it here like this have you seen that so you move down here okay just press your right click go to fill when you get to fill click on no fill okay and you come down to this field again and you come to the picture and these three things will pop up so if you add the icon from from icon if you download the icon already in your computer you can come down here so i have set of icon i want to use under my file here in my computer you can press this one now so when you press this it will pop up and it will bring up this okay so it's is inside my desktop okay so let me bring it out here let me okay let me write the name that is a desktop so my desktop here now so let me check 
where the icon is okay is tutorial resources here so the first thing i will write down here is okay i think i have a b c x okay a i mean let me the word of a is okay apple i will insert it down here as you can see here so in this one now you have to copy it here you also copy it here also okay and you copy the next one here do you see that so you come down to this place and uh, insert the next option okay go to the fee and go to the picture and come down to this your file where you kept it so i i kept book okay book so insert it down here also can you see and you come down to this place also you right click here go to the field when you get to the field go to the picture and now this picture i have c okay which is okay i have show also there so and then the last one a b c that is start go down to the right click here and then you go to the fill so the picture so you come down to your okay where you keep this one and then so you put down this one and you insert it okay so as you can see here this is the question number one for the puppies okay and then you come down to this place and we are going to write the next option here okay question two question two now okay question two question two so under the question two is to you know match the upper case with lower case okay so that is how to set it now match okay match the upper case the upper case upper case and match the upper case with lower case okay with lower case with lower case with lower case okay as you can see this one now we just have to come down to this place and then we have to match it and what we are going to do is to come down to insert okay when you get to the insert come down to the shape here yeah? when you come down to the shape come down here and then you have to write like this okay so don't forget you press your right click here and then you come down to the fill here so you write no fill okay no fill at all okay so the next thing to do is to come down here okay write your we have to write letter a okay letter a here and then you have to increase it a little bit so that for the pure purpose to see it very well increase the fonts a little bit we have to highlight it here just highlight like this and go to home increase the font okay so that is letter a and then you come down to here and you copy copy is just press your control key and just draw draw it can you see that okay you draw this one also okay and you draw this one also all right so the next one here what to type here now is to write b 
expressões e Amelisones e Andersones B. And then this one is C. Uh, sorry, this one is going back here. Letter A. And letter B. Letter C. Letter D. Okay? So we have to shape Shake this one up and then we highlight this one. You can write it in the copy. Press your shift key. Shift key. Shift key. Shift key. Shift key. Just press your shift key like that so that you'll be able to move the four together. Okay. You'll be able to move down the four together here. As you can see here now, so that we'll be able to set up our our lower case, okay? So just write lower case here. A. So you can put D here. D. You can put. You can put B here. So and then you can put. See, see here. Okay, as you can see, this this is how to set a question, and then the next thing to do is that you have to put a guideline to this place. You go to you go back to your view. When you get to the view, you can click on this guideline. As you can see, the question is beautified now. So as you can see here, this this is just to not to waste much of our time. As you can see, you can see the way I set up this question paper for the nursery school now in order to get this. So this is exactly the way you can set a, a, a professional question paper for your nursery school, okay? And if you find this tutorial useful, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and make sure you comment down below, okay, guys? 